La Naval was added to her title after a series of victories of the Spanish troops over the Dutch invaders in the 17th century, which were attributed to her intercession. The annals of history attest to the veracity of Mary's miraculous intervention, famous for the five naval battles in 1646 against the invading Dutch fleet. The naval captain sought the aid of Our Lady of the Holy Rosary to help them against the invaders, with a vow that all the defenders will walk barefoot in procession towards her shrine in the old Santo Domingo church in Intramuros, if their prayers were answered. Mustering only two old, ill-equipped galleons to defend the islands, the Spanish and Filipino defenders successfully defeated the larger and more powerful Dutch ships in five consecutive battles in the waters around Manila. Hence, the Blessed Mother was referred to as the Señora Grande de Filipinas on account of the many favors attributed to her. Uh, with very clear interrelationship or association between the devotion to Our Lady of the Rosary, the prayer of the Rosary, the promise, uh, the vow uh, to uh, have this uh, pilgrimage uh, on foot to Our Lady's shrine, Santo Domingo in Manila, if they won, and uh, the victory. So this close association of prayer, a promise, and the victory themselves consistently within the five uh, battles of 1646 uh, made the superior of Manila, uh, Dominicans, propose that it be recognized or the series of victories be recognized as by divine intervention through the intercession of Blessed Mother. And by 1652, the witnesses, the accounts had been submitted and they were evaluated and they had been officially declared as inexplicable uh, from a natural standpoint and that they were the work of God and God through the prayers and intercession of the Blessed Mother had granted victory to um, the uh, armed forces in those two miserable ships that fought in 1646.